hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. And welcome back to Strawberry Dreams ASMR. And welcome back to Scripture Sunday Bible Reading. Today, we will be picking back up in Mark chapter 3. We will be reading Mark chapter 3 today. I hope that you have had a wonderful week and this is the Bible that I will be reading from. It is a Holman Christian Standard Version of the Bible. A Holman Christian Standard Version. to this particular Bible because it is very aesthetically pleasing to me. I find this Bible to be very aesthetically pleasing. Do you have a particular Bible that you are fond of? Let's turn to Mark chapter 3. Let's see. Mark is, of course, in the New Testament. It is one of the four Gospels. It happens to be the second book of the New Testament, coming after Matthew. Coming after Matthew. begins on page 1,296. 1,296. Now he entered the synagogue again, and a man was there who had a paralyzed hand. In order to accuse him, they were watching him closely to see whether he would heal him on the Sabbath. He told the man with the paralyzed hand, Stand before us. Then he said to them, Is it lawful on the Sabbath to do what is good or to do what is evil? Is it lawful on the Sabbath to do what is good or to do what is evil? To save life or to kill? But they were silent. After looking around at them with anger and sorrow at the hardness of their hearts, he told the man, Stretch out your hand. So he stretched it out, and his hand was restored. So he stretched it out, and his hand was restored. Immediately, the Pharisees went out and started plotting with the Herodians against him, how they might destroy him. 
Jesus departed with his disciples to the sea, and a large crowd followed. From Galilee, Judea, Jerusalem, Adume, Idumea, 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 beyond the Jordan and around the Tyre and Sidon. The large crowd came to him because they had heard about everything he was doing. They had heard about everything that he was doing. Then he told the disciples to have a small boat ready for him, so the crowd would not crush him. Since he had healed many, all who had diseases were pressing toward him to touch him. Whenever the unclean spirits saw him, those possessed fell down before him and cried out, You are the Son of God, and he would strongly warn them not to make him known. He would strongly warn them not to make him known. I may have completely tangled this bracelet. Did I? Did I tangle it? I don't think I did. How do we go? How does it go? Come on now. Come on. Come on. I think it goes like this. Yes. I didn't completely tangle it. It's alright. It's alright. I have a bit of a disclaimer. The part that I'm about to read, I am not quite certain that I am going to pronounce these names correctly. So if I completely butcher the names, please forgive me. I'm doing the best to my ability. The best of my ability. I'm going to say them the way that I think they should be pronounced. Then he went up the mountain and summoned those he wanted, and they came to him. He appointed twelve. He also named them apostles, to be with him, to send them out to preach, and to have authority to drive out demons. He appointed the twelve. To Simon he gave the name Peter to James, the son of Zebedee, and to his brother John, he gave the names Boanerges, that is, sons of thunder, Andrew, Philip, and Bartholomew. I've got to turn the page. I just, I've got to turn the page. Hang on just a moment. Matthew and Thomas. James the son of Alphaeus, and Thaddeus, Simon the Zealot, and Judas Iscariot, who also betrayed him. Then he went home, and they... Then he went home, and the crowd gathered again, so that they were not even able to eat. When his family heard this, they set out to restrain him, because they said, he's out of his mind. He's out of his mind. The scribes who had come down from Jerusalem said, he has Beelzebul in him. And he drives out demons by the ruler of demons. So he summoned them and spoke to them in parables. How can Satan drive out Satan? If a kingdom is divided against itself, that kingdom cannot stand. If a house is divided against itself, that house cannot stand. And if Satan rebels against himself and is divided, 
he cannot stand, but is finished. On the other hand, no one can enter a strong man's house and rob his possessions unless he first ties up the strong man. Then he will rob his house. I assure you, people will be forgiven for all sins, and whatever blasphemies they may blaspheme, but whoever blasphemes against the Holy Spirit never has forgiveness but is guilty of an eternal sin, because they were saying he has an unclean spirit. Then his mother and his brothers came, and standing outside they sent word to him, and called him. A crowd was sitting around him and told him, Look! Your mother, your brothers, and your sisters are outside asking for you. He replied to them, Who are my mother and my brothers? And looking at those who were sitting in the circle around him, he said, Here are my mother and my brothers. Whoever does the will of God is my brother and sister and mother. Whoever does the will of God is my mother and sister and brother. And that is the end of chapter 3 of Mark. Do you like my mini mouse? I have decided to reestablish myself as a Disney travel agent. So after I have updated all of my training, I will be booking Disney travel experiences again. It is something that I did a while ago and took a break from, but it's something that I love, and I am excited to get back to it. I am very excited to get back to putting on my Minnie Mouse hat and getting it to work. I am excited to get back to work planning Disney vacation. And I am sure that in the near future, I will be able to do a Disney role play, and perhaps we can plan a Disney vacation together. Would you like that? Would you like for me to plan a Disney vacation for you? I would love to help you plan your Disney vacation. I hope you are having a wonderful evening, or a wonderful morning wonderful day. Wherever you are and whatever you are doing, I hope that you are doing very well. Thank you for watching my channel and I hope to see you again in the next video.